What's going on my little piglets? It's your BFF Port Shop here and I'm coming at you with another update with Port Shop. A belated update with Port Shop. It is currently Tuesday, but I had yesterday off, so it feels like a Monday, but it's actually a Tuesday. It's Monday 2.0, Monday light, whatever you want to say. But I haven't made one of these in a hot minute. I'm going to do it like a fastest finger question, you know, a, a, a lightning round of why I haven't made a update with Port Shop in a hot minute. One, I had car trouble that uh, for two weeks, uh, my taillights weren't working. I got pulled over. I didn't drive my car for two weeks, took it to the shop, and it took them less than an hour to fix it. So let it sit there for two weeks in the drive driveway, and uh, it took them less than an hour to diagnose the problem and fix the problem. So I'm like, Whew. okay. Um, number two, my father-in-law was with us for the... Uh, the Mother's Day holiday and, and beyond and we uh, my wife took him home this weekend back to New Mexico and uh, for the uh, Memorial Day weekend so we had a we had a long day we had a long weekend and it was freaking awesome I had the whole place to myself I got some recording done and I got some uh, some uh, time to myself and uh, it, was, it was it was pretty freaking great I ain't gonna lie I missed my wife but whoo that was awesome um, I had time to uh, work on some writing and do some recording and editing and uh, got to watch a couple of movies that I've had in the uh, queue for a while and I got that. I watched Terrifier and Scream 6 and I watched a Jared Fogel documentary um, and uh, that guy's a piece of shit. <laughs> That's all I have to say about that. Um, and then I, I've, to, to this day, as of recording, I have recorded seven installments of San Andreas, and, uh, it's going to be 32 installments total. It's going to run from, uh, the first weekend of June until the, actually not the second, it's the second weekend of June until uh, i think it's june 8th to august 20th i'm doing three a week i was originally going to do four but i said nah fam let's do three a week and, and and go for it so some of the episodes so far are an hour and a half there are others that are 15 minutes there are some that are like right in the middle at like an hour and uh, an hour or so and uh, so it's 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 all over the place but uh so uh bring your popcorn Bring you a blankie, crank the AC because it's the summer and it's freaking hot already. Um, already sweating. And uh, yeah, just enjoy San Andreas. And also, I made an announcement on Facebook a few hours ago, but, or not Facebook, YouTube and Facebook also. Um, June Vlog Challenge of 2023 is vastly approaching. So that'll be starting on uh, Thursday is when the June Vlog Challenge is going to start. And uh, I am really excited about that. So I'm asking y'all, I'm asking the piglets to leave me questions, leave me topics of discussion, leave me anything you want to talk about and you want me to talk about. Um, leave it down below, leave it in the community tab, comment that I made on the post. Um, and uh, just, just enjoy the June Vlog Challenge. I'm excited to do this again this year and uh, I always look forward to doing this every year. And uh, for those of you that are new, June Vlog Challenge, I do one vlog a day the entire month of June. That's kind of like the midpoint of the year, you know, seeing where I am, seeing where I want to be for the uh, remainder of the year and uh, talk about life and, and uh, pop culture and anything else that pops into my head and uh, just have a good old time. I usually try to let it be like a, a viewer based, like viewer driven series. So. I try to get people's comments and questions and concerns and stuff out in the open. If not, then I'll, uh, I'll freestyle and find something to talk about. Um, and so I'm excited to do that for y'all this year. And uh, I like seeing where, you know, it's, it's obviously a, a video diary. It's a vlog that I can, you know, play back, you know, years from now and be like, oh, I remember being in that spot in my life. I remember, oh remember when I used to have it so bad and it's gotten so much better in this aspect of my life or oof 
I miss that so much, you know, stuff like that, you know, talking about, you know, you know, friends and communities and, you know, stuff like that, and just, uh, it's like a snapshot of my life, uh, right along with the food reviews and everything else that I post these videos, um, on this channel. So, please, like I said, don't hesitate to leave me a comment, question, concern, whatever, and I will get to it in a timely manner. So thank y'all so much. Um, glad to be doing this again. I've missed doing the vlogs. I've missed uh, being able to uh, talk with y'all and talk to y'all and just, um, just, just, just being just a talking head of a person that likes to hear the sound of his own voice sometimes. There are some times when I listen to playback and I'm like, fuck. Um, but I've, I've missed talking to y'all because it's uh, cathartic, to say the least, to talk to y'all and uh, to uh, get my feelings and, you know, stories and stuff out in the open. Um, I also do the exact same thing with the June Vlog Challenge, just amplified to a daily basis. And uh, also, um, while I'm playing San Andreas, I'm actually talking to you guys about some personal stuff and stories and really looking forward to y'all viewing that as well. Um, that being said, um, I have a couple of things. I stopped by the stove today, so giving y'all a little sneak peek of uh, some of the things I'm going to be reviewing for June. Um, first of all, I have a video for next. I had a video today, so please go watch that. It's the uh, my review of the uh, Atkins uh, caramel apple pie uh, snack bar. Um, and the next week is going to be a another Prime video where I review um, the uh, ice pop flavor of Prime. Um, and so the week after that might be uh, a food. And then the week after that, I have the uh, lemon lime Prime, which that's fun to say, lemon lime Prime. And then because I've said this multiple times on this channel and it rings true, um, I decided to give Rise Fuel Energy Tropical Punch Zero Sugar Kool-Aid. Oh, yeah. And uh, I'm a sucker for Tropical Punch anything. Fruit Punch, Tropical Punch. I'm here for it. So I'm really excited about that as well. So uh, giving you a little sneak peek, giving you a little reward for watching the video right now to uh, tell you guys what's in the queue. Also, um, uh, the food I, I said I was probably going to review for next, uh, not next week, but the week after, um, is a exclusive flavor of Pringles that you can only get at Walmart, and it is a hot honey Pringles. So, uh, I'm really looking forward to that. I'm just saying, that, that looks freaking great. It's been sitting in my office for a few weeks. I'm just like, I can't wait to tear into that. Um, that or your mom. I I go back and forth with which one I can't wait to tear into the most. Um, yeah, I went there, my bad. Uh, <laughs> but that being said, uh, hope you guys just enjoy the vlogs coming up. I hope you guys are, are doing well. Hope you guys are, you know, kicking ass and taking names. And uh, whether it be your life or your job or your marriage or college or whatever you're going through, I hope things are, are, are going well. And I uh, greatly appreciate y'all so much for coming onto the channel and watching the food reviews, which I think my last one that I posted has almost, if not over slightly 200 views. So uh, that's the, uh, the Doritos uh, Cool Ranch Papadilla from Pizza, not Pizza, Pizza Hut, uh, Papa John's. So, um, everybody that's watched that, thank you so much. Anybody that hasn't yet, go watch it. Go do, go do the damn thing. I appreciate y'all. Um, and then the vlogs, which are going to be 30 in a row. So, uh, it's not a sprint, it's a marathon. So, uh, go for it. 30-day marathon of that. And uh, I'm going to try to figure out something. I have a few things in mind, because usually I try to do like a... Uh, you know, a song a day or, you know, a, uh, you know, something that got stuck in my head. You know, I, actually last year I did a, uh, song challenge 
it's you know like you know a song that reminds you of your childhood or you know a song that makes you want to dance you know a song that shows that you have good taste in music um, I think I might do that with movies this uh, this year I'll uh, see if I can find a uh, like 30 day template and see if I can uh, go from there but uh, yeah hope that I covered all the bases so far for uh, what's going on um, in, in my life there's really not that much going on we just had Mother's Day which was a busy busy holiday and then um, I had Memorial Day weekend to myself so I uh, watched movies and and uh, did videos and you know just mostly just you know by myself in my house treat myself like an animal that's pretty much what I did um, got a pretzel crust pizza that I ate for um, dinner and uh, or lunch and dinner that same day and uh, devoured a, a two liter diet Pepsi by myself in less than 24 hours um, which that's rookie that's a rookie number but uh, still I was very proud that I could consume that before it went flat because it was starting to taste a little flat even after a day um, and then um, got a deluxe craving box the one that I did for the uh, food review or the uh, food favorite um, and uh, really excited about that uh, this week is a local food review so it looks like y'all have chosen the uh, the zombie burger from zombies um, I think that's what it was called it's one of the burgers there, there's a burger joint here called zombies it's a like a bar and grill and uh, yet to try it but I've heard good things about zombies but uh, yeah I gotta stop real quick at the store and grab something for dinner tonight um, we're making ribs, so I was uh, put in charge of going to get the barbecue sauce on my titties um, because uh, there's a guy named G. Hughes that uh, does uh, sugar-free products. So uh, that man, God bless that man. I would kiss him on the forehead if I ever encountered that man. Um, he makes really good uh, sugar-free salad dressings and, and marinades and sauces. There's even a sugar-free ketchup. It's actually pretty good. Um, I put it in my uh, sloppy joes that I made last week. Hurry up, people. <laughs> uh, but anyway, guys, I'm going to get out of here. Thank you all so much once again for dropping by. I greatly appreciate you all. Like I said, questions, comments, concerns down below for the June Vlog Challenge. and uh, Or just in general, just to shoot the shit. Anything you're interested in talking about, let's discuss. Let's have a discussion. And always remember, my little piglets, Colin Porkchop loves y'all the most. As y'all take it easy, guys, and I will see y'all next time. Pulling into my spot right now at the stove. Bye, guys!